Halls Creek is situated in the Kimberley region of Western Australia, about 3,000 kilometres north of Perth, about 1,300 kilometres southwest of Darwin. The town is uh, about 1,000 people. 87% of the population are Indigenous Australians. Over the years, the town has attracted a lot of bad media attention with all the problems associated with the alcoholism. Problems like domestic violence, child abuse, fetal alcohol syndrome, youth suicide, just to name a few. The nation's answer to the problem has been government intervention. But we believe as a church, the only answer for the communities is a godly intervention. Is a godly intervention. And these are just some of the stories of the lives that have been changed. And Murray changed my life, I used to drink here. Yeah. yeah, where I'm sitting is my drinking spot, and I, I thank God for changing my life. It's so good to me here. Yeah. Work, and I'm an elder of the church. Preach the gospel to my people. Thank God what he's doing amongst my people. Setting people free, delivering people, setting them free, healing people. I thank God for his miracle. I just praise and thank the Lord that without the Lord being my saviour, I wouldn't be here today. I thank the Lord what he had done for me because he's my refuge and he's my comforter. I was the worst drinker. I used to stay at the bush every time working. Since I found Jesus, that changed my life. I never went back to the station job. Nope. I never went back to the grog again. I thanks God. I'm an elder in the church here. Preach God's word and reach out to the lost people, to my own people. And we see a lot of young, young, young people getting saved. I just want to thank God for what he's done for my life. In my life, I used to be a drunk, uh, young alcoholic. And I really thank the Lord that he changed my life to what I have been before. I used to be playing in the band, get drunk, partying with my friends. I used to do, I used to go house to house, looking for alcohol. But I thank the Lord he changed my life around. We believe that God has called us to train and equip Indigenous and non-Indigenous people to plant Aboriginal churches in the communities throughout Australia. Over the past six years, we've planted seven churches in different states throughout Australia. And some of these churches are having a real impact in their communities. One church in Wonka Jonka community, uh, that community had suicides in there on a regular basis. Every couple of months there was a young man that had committed suicide in that community. And the church has now been planted there 18 months and they haven't had one single suicide. And we believe that the only answer for the communities is to plant a church in those communities. That will bring about a lasting change. There's still much to do. There's about 400 communities across Australia. We've only got about 40 churches in those communities, so there's such a great work to be done. But we just want to thank you for partnering with us in reaching the Indigenous people of our nation for Jesus Christ. God bless you.